Yuck. Gross yucky day. I have arrived. I'm in a meeting all morning. But I think, if I can find my keys, we get Mandarin for lunch. Chinese. Good morning, Vlog Mayhem. We are just sitting here. It's actually dark and kind of dreary out today and snowy, if you can see. Cool. And we are just sitting here doing some school this morning. Ben's doing some math. Mia's also doing some math with stuff with time and uh, temperature. <laughs> and Joel's working on some coloring because he felt like coloring this morning. And it feels nice and cozy inside because it's like dark and snowy outside. So we're going to get started on our day. Say good morning. Good morning. Just finishing up school and there's leftover homemade broccoli soup for lunch, which is like Ooh. so nice. Meetings are done. I'm just waiting for the food now. It's taking forever to get here. It's only 11.44. It's not supposed to be here till 12. Yum. I don't know what I'm gonna do for 15 minutes. Something. The food is here. Look at all this food. Look at all the gluten. Amanda gets to eat as much as she wants. Please don't put this in the vlog. <laughs> oh, the rolls! I forgot about the rolls! Lunch was really good. Except I had way too much. We don't have it that often, so I think maybe that's why I did it. I had five plates of mandarin. They weren't all full, though. Of course not. And, um, you know, my got my fortune cookie here. Um, a, conf, a confidential tip will clue you into great financial deal. I don't know about that. Look at this. Ben has his whole collection of Lego guys out. I, I think there's a lot of Lego guys. There's, there's a little bit here. more. Like, look at the news, he's the news the team is here, literally. Yeah, what is the news team here for? Um, they're gonna, they're, because they're gonna count every okay, year. I love they count motion. how many people there he are. Cool. Yeah. So the kids are playing Lego, and we've had a really productive, like, school day. So that's been awesome. We got a lot of schoolwork done. Getting back into the groove. And I have a goal for, like, just going forward into the new year. I really want to just... Focus on, in the house, being more minimal. So like, not having so much clutter. I find a lot of clutter just makes me feel like stressed out. So I wanna just like too many toys or too many this or too many that. So I wanna just focus on like one little area a day until I hopefully declutter my whole house. And I know that sounds like a lot and it sounds crazy, but it's just one of my goals. Like I don't know if I'll actually get it all done or whatever but it's just something i've been thinking about and i was talking to chris about it yesterday and i was like i just need to like declutter and minimalize so the first thing i'm going to start with is our laundry room slash linen closet but um our linen closet is like not very good size and i can never really fit even our towels in it but that's only because it's full of just other old sheets and blankets that like we don't even probably need or use so i'm going to go through those See what we actually need um, to keep for like the beds that we do have. And if we don't need it, I'm going to donate it. Um, yeah, so hopefully the goal is the linen closet today. And I'm going to show it to you right now. And I honestly haven't even looked in it. Like I haven't even opened it and looked in it for probably at least like a half a year. So I'm going to show you like truly what it looks like and what I'm going to have to work with. Okay, so this is it. You'll notice that the... Um, what's this called again? Ironing board. <laughs> it can't even fit in there. So this is what it looks like. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Wrapping paper, random things. So we're going to go through all of this right now. <laughs> What is 
that, Joel? I don't know. That used to be yours when you were a baby. Actually, it was Ben's and then Mia's and then yours. So I think we'll donate that to the pregnancy center. Yeah, because it still works as long as you put batteries in it. I'm finding lots of baby stuff, like snowsuits that used to be the kids and blankets and stuff. And we don't need baby stuff anymore. Back on this side of the building. Missed it. It's been a while. I'm going to pull out this... Uh, this piano in here and put it back on stage. Hola, did you I did a while ago. What's up? What's up? <laughs> Unbelievable. I knew it was either a bug or your Birkenstocks. Okay, if you have followed us for a while, you've known that literally the whole summer long, I looked for my Birkenstocks and I could not find them in the whole entire house. Well, guess where they were? <laughs> they were in the litter closet, which I've got almost cleared out now. But seriously, the day after we get back from Florida, I find my Birkenstocks. Is not always the way. I'm just glad I found them because I have been looking for those for like a year and I finally found them. I'm so happy. They're only a year old and I had just got them when I lost them pretty much. And so I was really sad that I lost them because Birkenstocks aren't cheap and like I saved up to get those and whatever. So I'm so glad I found them. <laughs> but the progress is doing good. I've got a bag for donating to the pregnancy center of like baby stuff and then I've got nicer stuff like um, nice towels and linens and placemats and stuff that I don't use anymore for donation. And then just a small bag of garb, like stuff to throw out that's not really anything anyone would want. But I'm totally gonna be able to fit my towels in here now, so that is so good. It always feels good to do stuff like this. Like even though you don't really feel like doing it and you're like, oh, I don't feel like it, it always feels so good when you're finished. So anyway, I'm gonna get back to organizing and then I'll show you the finished product. Okay, I got the kids helping. They're finding matches for socks. And here is my progress so far. It's looking pretty good. I'm quite pleased. And we're gonna keep going. Okay, I'm back. I got my hammer. Oh, it's loud. Looking good. All right, piano is in. I'm ready to go. Computer goes here. This is their in ears. Hit the control the loops and plug the loops in, plug the piano in. It's all good. I think it even turns on. Let's check. Oh, yeah. So it is 4 45, it is already like getting dark out. And I'm just working on making some dinner tonight. I'm gonna make something fairly easy. Oh, let me turn on the light. Pew. <laughs> but I'm gonna make some grilled cheeseburger wraps. So basically all you do is you take some onion, ground beef, and you cook it up with some like steak spice, some Worcestershire sauce, and a little bit of ketchup, Worcestershire sauce. <laughs> then you take a tortilla, 
like a fairly large tortilla. Sorry, the lighting's so bad. Um, and you put the tortilla on like a frying pan, like this, and you fill it with some of the meat mixture, some freshly sliced tomatoes, some cheese, and you can do mustard. Um, and basically, you grill it up um, so it gets all melty and whatever, and then you flip it, same thing, and then that's that's your dinner so it's pretty easy but it's really yummy and i think both the boys will for sure eat it mia probably won't eat it but she's my pickiest one but anyway i just thought i'd share that recipe with you because it's really easy and yummy hello ruby hello you did yeah you made one no he did oh ben made one yeah cool well, I can't wait to see it. By the way, that's what it looks like inside when it's done. Good evening, everyone. So, Mommy and Mia went out to... I think they went to the dollar store to get some bins or something. And I just put Joel down. Boys had a shower. They're all in bed. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, someone asked how our basement reno is going. Well... I haven't done anything on it really in the last like two or three weeks just because I was getting ready to go on vacation and then I was on vacation so I'm hope actually hoping to um, kind of tile that up fingers crossed over the next week or so so you should be you should be seeing some progress updates soon so I guess I'll just wait for Charlie to get home well I guess if I want to get some work done in the basement this week I need to first tackle the mess of the basement. Here we go. can work. Mia helped a little bit. I'm helping on this car. Sand this all out. Paint it all up. Put the door on that thing. Finish the ceiling up here. I'm helping the corner here. Put a TV on the wall there. It's all gonna be good when I'm done. Hello, hello, hello. It's time for night night. <laughs> <laughs> we worked a lot today. You worked on the basement. Mm -hmm. And I worked on the closet and stuff like that and I did all the laundry room too I forgot to add so oh yeah <coughs> totally did you, did you um, vlog that yeah okay oh I vlogged it oh cool it was needed so <laughs> yeah what was your high point my high point was finding my work in stocks <laughs> Because I look for them, and you have looked for them everywhere all summer year long, and we finally found them. Camera might Hi. die. I screamed, and you were FaceTiming me when I found them. So I was like, "Aren't you so glad you FaceTimed me during that moment?" That moment, <laughs> I saw the whole thing happen. You did. So anyway, um, my high point was that Shelly found her Birkenstocks because <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty exciting. So they're expensive. She thought uh, that I donated them. I did but I for didn't. a time. I didn't. I didn't donate them. them. Yeah. You hid them in your little laundry room in a little plastic bag from... Florida. Yeah. From so. Florida last year. Yeah. Yeah. So, sad that she couldn't wear it this year, but oh well. <laughs> They're just saying it. All right. We're going to call it a night. Camera's going to die any second. Hope you figured out that we are uploading at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll see you again tomorrow. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Later. See ya. See ya.